script, how to change the key of a project in Cubase step-by-step. -step. Hey everyone, welcome back to Techie Dialogue. In today's video, I'm going to show you how to change the key of a project in Cubase step-by-step. -step. This is a useful feature that can really help you find the perfect key for your track. If you haven't subscribed yet, make sure you hit that subscribe button for more Cubase tutorials and tips. Step 1. Let's start with the project root key, a very cool feature in Cubase. You can find this option right at the top of the project window. If you don't see the project root key on your screen, no worries. All you need to do is go to the top right of the project window and click on Setup Toolbar. From there, make sure that project root key is checked on. This will allow you to change the key of the entire project with just one click. Step 2. To check it's working, select any MIDI or audio event in your project and look at the info line at the top of your screen. You should see a root key info section there. If there's no key information for that event, don't worry. Just right click here and enable the root key display. Step 3. Now that you can see the root key info for each event, Changing the project root key will automatically update the key for all events that have key information. It's a quick way to try out different keys and find the perfect fit for your track. And that's it. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next video.